Show 2022 and we are at the Mantis booth today and we are learning some of their new stuff that they have. Not out yet, but you're going to get a sneak peek about this and there's going to be more details with this to come. So we're going to explain to you this new details and this new Mantis that's going to help you train and get better as a shooter as it has for me. So here we go. So uh, this is a speed target drill with the, blank, with the Blackbeard X. Uh, what we're looking at as you uh, shooting at targets and spreading across, not just staying stationary. What we're going to look at is how fast you are, it takes you to break the shot and how long it takes you after you break the shot to move away. So we're going to show you basically, could you show, shoot any faster with the Blackbeard X? What we're going to see is that every time you pull the trigger, it's going to give you these trace views similar to the Mantis X. Up top, it's going to give you your total delay and how much faster you potentially could have shot, which we're looking at a 6% and a total of about 18 seconds. What we're going to see is each one of these shots, typically that delay is going to come when you over travel or when you stop on a target. Ideally, you want to shoot straight through and that's going to give you the minimal delay. So if we see any shots here with a little bit of delay on them, towards the end here, you can see that little bit of a stop and an over travel, which is going to cause you just a little bit of delay. All of those across all your shots are going to add up to a significant amount of time where you could potentially shoot 10, 20% faster. We're going to look at as you break the trigger, that's you going from one target to the next. Or you could double tap and we can show you how much you're deviating on your double tap as well. You'll see the blue is the transition coming onto the target. Yellow is the motion coming onto the target. If there's any type of delay, you're going to see a little bit of the orange that's going to add up to uh, your total delay at the top. So this one, I'm shooting 38% slower, and you're going to see a lot of delay on a few of these shots. So on shot number four, I swing past the target, and I get that delay section right there, which is a half a second before I could have broken the sugar. If I broke it right here, without that over travel, I could have got shot that much faster. If I double tap on the same shot, you'll see that uh, how much I'm moving as well. And you're going to see that there's about a 0.2 second delay just making a double tap, making a small adjustment, stopping as well. Whereas this one is a significantly better one, no movement at all. And on this shot, you can see something very horribly went wrong. There's about 1.4 seconds worth of delay, over travel, stopping, all of that adds up to a significant delay at the top. Want to give it a shot? Yeah. Okay, and then you wait at the beat. I'm just aiming it anywhere on the target or just bullseye or... Aim at the bullseye, but you're trying to sweep across to get the best. Keep going or... No, you're good. 20 shots. Alright. And they hit the stop button here. Okay. Let's see how bad I did. <laughs> or how great you did. So we're at the top here, took 20 shots, took about eight seconds to complete, and we're seeing about a one second delay. So you could have shot about 13% quicker. We're gonna see, as you come onto your first target, there's a little bit of delay just as you're getting on the target. Your double taps, you're moving slightly, but no delay. As you tr blue transition into your next target, no delay, good. If we look at one of the slower shot, if there's anyone in here. These actually look pretty good. As you transition to your next target, you're not stopping, you're not over traveling at all. You're getting that nice shot in between, double tap, just a little bit of movement, and you sweep across into your next target. Awesome. All right, very cool. This is going to be an amazing, amazing more training yeah. uh, for that I can bring out to everybody else, and yeah. I'm super excited about this. So thank you so much for showing it to me. Yeah. I appreciate it. And this is Elise. This is the one that I've been uh, communicating with oh, via email. So this is the first time that we have actually met at SHOT Show and I'm uh, honored to have met you Absolutely. and I'm super grateful for all of the support that you guys have given. You're back. Glad to do it. Yeah, I'm, I'm, ready, I'm ready to do more. So that looks pretty good, but if you want to test just to make sure it's good. Okay, I'll start. Okay, I'm down to three.
So the timer can't hit zero. Gotcha. So you were out running it. It was trying to hit zero. Uh, so <laughs> okay, I'll take that. <laughs> so. Awesome. Awesome. Hey, this is Drop It Like It, Scott. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time. Shot Show 2022.